This is a PSA for pirated radio stations. We're asleep in the American dream. Let's get awake and face it. I've waited all my life for freedom, running out of patience. We turn the new world into a sick suburban nation. I'll paint a portrait of the burbs so you can see the basis of my hatred for this absurd stasis we've created. You look around and see nothing but a sea of neighbors racistly segregated by the real estate agents, physically separated by the architect's visions. Our dwellings are set up for solitary existence, supposedly rich but poor in terms of real living. Cookie cutter castles fit for kings have become prisons. And don't you dare to be young or grow old neither. Ain't no room for y'all in the nuclear family ether. Kids and senior citizens both need chauffeuring. If you can't drive, then you die. But don't worry. Everyone drives around here, ain't got another way to move. Sure, there's buses and trains, but really ain't no routes. No way to bike along an eight-lane outer loop. We inundate the innards of the cities with our crowded crews. Cause we always need to work to keep buying nourishment. Ain't shit growing on our lawns, but farms are flourishing, sort of. The man for machine trade has been made, and the rate and size of produce exponentially inflates. So we're healthy. At least so says the popular opinion of it, but most of us are mentally insane pinions, crab bucket syndrome. I'm trying to get out, but they claw on me. Solidarity, in conformity, bottle in reality. Sell it to me straight at the Walmart. Disillusionment and depression in the shopping cart. Make a quick stop at the liquor store's mini bar. Have a few shots of whiskey pay with a credit card. Far from in the black, I'm in the red, baby. Debt's crazy. The economy crashed last week. Damn tail chasing, bail baiting bank bastards. Get them in the clink fast. We love to blame others than ourselves for the hassles of modernity incarnate. Attempted technotopia, obviously bullshit, some dangerous myopia. Work is just an okie dope, they permanently roping you. Feeling like a hopeful dope at a silent symposium. Town hall's really just a place for panhandlers, and in the suburbs all we got's a clubhouse and grandstand. Shit, it's cool for baseball, but what about the zoning laws? I guess I get a vote, but they can't count them for the Oval Office. I feel immobile often, like I'm in a local coffin. I'm not joking, most times I cannot manage walking. I need a quart of milk, some smokes, and a pound of coffee. Revolutionary road, my ass, please let me off it. The mere existence of the path on which we're taking steps renders regions bleeding with disease. How could we forget? Ain't no patriarchal gods or churches if our mommy's dead. We all need to re-believe in people, like Duwani said. I'll quote the book just to prove I know my shit. You won't take me serious if I'm not actually legit. He says communal space is key within a human habitat. Well, in suburbs, we're all sectioned off alone. How whack is that? Let's not use as templates for a new design the broken ones. All these rusty cities' ashes, misappropriated funds. We'll shape it up right. Blaze a new trail like a blunt. Ain't saying fuck life, but fuck the way we get it done. Look, ain't naught but residences for several miles in each direction. Arterial roads for automobiles are our main veins to seek connection. We need the presence of a store, and more than that, a section of each block reserved for shops and some social resurrection. Better yet, beyond the civics. Abandoned Babylonic systems. Civilized structures are inherently resistant to the Tao. Talking about some bring them down now shit. That's the most important task. Doubtless.